Oh, don't worry, sweetie. I'm almost finished. I'm just going to do a bit of cleaning around the house. and Then I'll come and tend to you and look after your wounds and help you relax a little bit, all right? <laughs> don't mind me. I just got to finish up with this dusting. Oh, it gets so messy in here. <laughs> it's funny. You're almost as small as these little bits of dust. <laughs> oh, you little cutie. All right, that just about does it. The house is almost spotless. <laughs> Perfect, just how I like it. Now you sit back. I'm going to help put on some new bandages and I'll help wash your face and your hair and I'll give you a nice little head massage while we're at it. Let me bandage up your head. Oh, you must have hit it real bad when you fell down. Don't you worry. You'll be right as rain soon, with me looking after you. <laughs> I will make you better. Trust me, I know what I'm doing. Oh, it's so funny to me how you can be just so small. I gotta cut these bandages up so tiny just to fit your head. <laughs> oh. Strange, isn't it? How the world can be like this. You're very lucky, though, that you've got me. <laughs> most other men are just slaves or like cockroaches under most girls' feet. <laughs> You'd best never try to escape or go out by yourself. You would be squished underfoot in an instant. You know, all my friends tease me about you. They wonder how I could be with such a tiny little helpless thing. But it doesn't matter, even though you are so, so small. <laughs> oh, it's all right. Oh, does that feel better? Good. <laughs> I'm glad to hear it. I'll help you feel much better. It'll take you a long time to heal from your injuries, so. But you are definitely on the mend. <laughs> All right. Let me just give you a nice little head massage, and I'll brush your hair out, too. Oh, it does get messy lying in bed all day. <laughs> Not that you can do much else. You know, you are, well, <laughs> Helpless, defenseless, useless, all of the above. <laughs> oh, don't look at me like that. I can barely even make out your facial expressions. You're so small down there. <sighs> Though I must say it is rare these days to have a male companion, let alone a husband. All the men just seem to die off. I guess they would die pretty quickly and easily. Most women wouldn't even notice them down below. They just get trampled or left out or forgotten about. But that's understandable with how women are so much bigger than men. I mean, I'm what, about 55 feet tall? And you, you're... You're not even a foot. You're barely even half. What, five or six inches? <laughs> You're absolutely tiny. It's ridiculous. Mm -hmm. What's that? Oh, you want me to take you to work? But you got fired. You gotta collect something, or... A severance package? Huh. All right, then. That is strange. I never heard of a man getting one of those. <laughs> but
But all right, I'll pick you up and I'll take you there. Come on then, let's go. I'm sure Scarlet will be very surprised to see you. Girls, let's get on with some more experiments. See how we can really change the world for the better. <laughs> At least the better for us, I suppose. <sighs> well, now that we're all so beautiful, I think the first thing that we should do is make makeup useless. <laughs> we can eradicate it from existence. We're all so beautiful and youthful and practically immortal. We have no use for silly makeup anymore. Right, let's just put that into the device. Ah, okay. Right, this should rewrite reality and make makeup obsolete. <laughs> oh, oh, my face feels a bit different. Yes, I don't have any makeup on anymore. Not that I was wearing much to begin with. And all of you ladies too. Oh, we're all so gorgeous without it. We don't need it at all. <laughs> hmm, what else can we do? Oh, oh, you, I almost forgot about you down there. <laughs> Our little male test subject. It's very helpful to be able to see how you react when we put different commands into the device. Just to keep an eye on how you men are doing. <laughs> you tiny little thing down there. Oh, it must be so terrifying looking up at all of us. We could squish you in an instant. <laughs> Especially if we keep playing with our little device and changing reality as much as we want. I could put some code into it and make you disappear all in an instant. <laughs> there would be no memory of you for anyone throughout history. All your female co-workers, family and friends would forget about you. <laughs> oh, I'm just teasing. Don't look so scared. Come on, girls, how about we make ourselves just a bit bigger? It can't hurt, can it? <laughs> and let's shrink the boys down a little bit while we're at it. Let me just put the code in. Ah, there, ready? Here we go. <laughs> oh. Just all the way down there, so small you are. Oh, girls, I think we're about 75 feet now, aren't we? I might have made the code a little bit too strong. <laughs> oh, and look, he's been shrunk down to be, what, three inches tall? Absolutely tiny and ridiculous. <laughs> look at him. Oh, I can barely even see him down there. <laughs> Wait, let me get my magnifying glass. Oh, let's see. Oh, oh my goodness. You're so small that even the magnifying glass can't even pick you up. <laughs> oh, you're so stupid and little. Look at you. <laughs> oh. Hmm, you know what I want, girls? I've always wanted wider hips, a smaller waist, and much larger uh, assets towards the front. Hmm, how about we do a little bit of beautification? 
I want my figure to be more womanly. Doesn't that sound good? Oh, yeah, good idea. Yeah, of course. Yeah, of course. Let's do it. All right, let me put the code in. Oh, <laughs> oh that's it, girls. Can't you feel your body grow? What a marvellous feeling. Oh. <laughs> oh, so wonderful. Oh, and look at you down there. How silly little test subject. <laughs> you know what? I feel like perhaps we'd have a bit of fun shrinking you with this device. Hmm. Let me just pinpoint you individually into the device. Mm hmm. And then let me put in the shrinking code. Shrink you down about half your size now. A bit taller than an inch. Ah. <laughs> Oh, oh, down you go, that's it. Mm -hmm. <laughs> oh, so tiny, but not tiny enough. One more time, let's say a tenth of an inch now. Make you almost so tiny that I can hardly even see you. <laughs> You'll be a speck on my microscope. Down, down, down you go. Oh. <laughs> oh, but you're so small now, I can't even see you properly. Oh, how useless. You're no fun to tease if I can't even see you properly. Oh, well... I suppose it's time to put you poor thing out of your misery. Oh, now, let me just... There you are. And I'll put my finger down right on top of you, and... Oh, <laughs> there we go. Ugh. Smeared on my finger. Let me just wipe that off. Ugh. <laughs> I've got some man on my finger. <laughs> Oh, girls, I never thought this device would be so much fun. <sighs> oh, but it appears our device might need a little bit of a break. I'll have to log in and try and get it to cool down. I think it's starting to overload a little bit. Let's see, let me just log in here. Oh, wait a minute. I don't remember putting a password on this. Oh, it must have been him. Oh, I can't believe it. I should have gotten him to change it before I fired him. Oh, well, this won't do at all. Oh no, the machine is overloading. Girls, help me with this. Do you know what the password is? Oh, shit. Shit, shit, shit. What are we going to do? Oh, that bastard. What the fuck are we going to do? The device is overloading, just like before. This is how this whole thing started. Oh, no. Wait. Wait, where are you girls going? Why are you running? We need to fix this. We need to... 